But Elena, what are the normal values actually? Well, yes, reference values are very important. Uh, however, there is some uncertainty in the literature about the actually normal values of the RV systolic strain. Till recently, uh, there was only one meta-analysis published two years ago. And as you can see here, the average uh, normal value for RV free wall strain was around minus 27, 27 plus minus 2%. Well, a year ago, the largest currently existing study, reference study, had been published and performed in the University of Padua. They involved 276 healthy volunteers. And if you look closer to the table, you can see that the six segments global RV longitudinal strain, the normal value is 25.8, with the low limit of normality minus 20%. And the RV free wall longitudinal strain minus 30.5% with the low limit of normality minus 23%. So there's a difference between these two values. Exactly. I think you have to understand that. But both of them are actually higher of as the left ventricle, right? Yes, that's completely true. And we have to uh, remember that actually the uh, RV free wall longitudinal strain value normally is even higher than the septal one or the global one, just because the very important contribution of the longitudinal contraction pattern uh, of the right ventricle towards the global systolic function. Are there actually any studies performed to look at the normal values for the different segments? Yes, uh, the segmental values had been analyzed in this study as well, and you can see them in this table. However, it's not currently recommended for routine use in clinical practice because, unfortunately, the reproducibility of strain value of segment strain values is not so high. All right. In your experience, could you say that one segment is usually more than the other, for example, the basal opposed to maybe the apical? Because in the left ventricle, we do have differences in the regional strain of the left ventricle. Well, actually, we can look at this table and we can see that normally the segmental value of uh, basal and mid uh, uh, segments of the right ventricle is slightly higher than the apical one. Uh, however, again, unfortunately, the uh, reproducibility of segmental strain values is not so high. So currently, it's more for the research purposes, not for routine clinical practice. I mean, I think you have to understand that, that the number of speckles we have for the right ventricle myocardium is significantly less, so I would probably also assume that there is more variation. Yes, that's right. Uh, there are recently published guidelines for cardiac chamber quantification. They were published before the uh, publication of the recent reference study. And uh, uh, we can see from there that uh, the suggested global longitudinal RV free wall strain more than minus 20%. So I mean minus 19, minus 18, minus 17 is likely to be abnormal. Yeah, so they are trying to be on this very safe side here, I would assume. Exactly, yes. Probably it's not very sensitive, mm -hmm. but it's very specific.